and welcome back to my channel or hello if you are new. So today I'm going to be doing a chatty get ready with me video. I'm going to meet my friend Olivia for a socially distanced walk which we are now allowed to do in the UK and yeah so I'm just getting ready for that basically. So I would just like to say before I started this video I have cleansed and moisturised my face which you should always do before you put your makeup on. I know a lot of us are lazy, me included, and don't always do that which is really bad but you should do it it looks after your skin a lot more and since I've been doing it on the regular it, like my skin is a whole lot better so please try and do it I know we don't always have time or we can't really be bothered but just just try so the first thing that I will be doing is my foundation which I use the Charlotte Tilbury airbrush flawless foundation which looks just like this and yeah that's what I'll be using first. I found with this foundation is you really don't need a lot of it it goes quite far um, and I also know that people say don't put it directly onto your face skin you should put it like on the back of your hand or something but I don't have time for that and um, yeah it's just easier to put it straight onto my face. Also I've got a mirror just down here so if I'm looking down a lot that's why I'm just been vain and looking at myself basically. Also don't forget to like blend it to your ears and down your neck otherwise you do get a line and I mean if that's the look you're going for go for that look but not particularly the look I fancy. So that's the foundation done it's just covered up but obviously you can still see my spots because I'm not too bothered about you being able to see my spots but it's covered them up a bit it's like made them less red and just made my skin a lot smoother in general. And then I move on to the eyebrows, which I use Sleek Makeup Microfine Eyebrow Pencil, which just looks like this. Um, that's what I use for my eyebrows. I'll explain what I do before I do it and then you guys can see. Basically, I start by brushing them out and then I draw like the outline of my eyebrows and then fill in the middle bit of them. I use this really, really lightly, especially now that I've got blonde hair because I know some people like the look and it looks amazing on some people when they have like blonde hair and like quite dark eyebrows still. It just really doesn't suit me. I think it might be my skin tone or something, I don't know, it really doesn't suit me. So I'm going for the lighter eyebrow look. So the next thing that I do is actually my eyeshadow. I'm going to be using this XX Revolution palette. I think I might go for a purpley pinky shimmery kind of look. That's, that's my vibe I'm going for today. We'll go with that. Again, I'm probably going to be using all the wrong brushes for this. This is just the brushes that I found that work for me. So first of all, I'm going to be dipping my brush into the colour Ash, which is like a pinky toned kind of colour. And I'm just going to be doing like the outside of my eye with this. See, I feel like this lockdown, the UK is now in their third lockdown. I think, I think the government are calling it the second lockdown because they didn't really class like the November time one but it's the third lockdown let's be real here and it's just a lot tougher than the first one I think the first one was all right because it was obviously the first time we were in lockdown we all got a bit of time off work we were like having a good time and it was summer it was such nice weather like I was going on so many walks with my family and it was so nice and then this time it's just like I think it's just a drain of like it being another lockdown and not being able to do anything it's so bad and obviously it's winter so it's not like we can go out for walks or anything like that because most of the time it's raining I mean in summer it rains a lot here in the UK too but yeah it's just really it's rubbish weather don't really want to go out. I'm then jumping into the colour Solar on this pan panel, on this palette, and it's more of a shimmery colour just for the centre of my eyelids. Mm -hmm. 
Next up, I'm going to be doing my bronzer and blush from the XX Revolution. Again, Distortion Complex Palette. If we're looking to like after lockdown, I'm quite looking forward to it. Obviously, things are opening very slowly here, so um there's like different stages that things are opening but after lockdown i've got a few shows planned um which i'm going to be doing which i'm really excited for because it's been over a year now since i've done a show and that's heartbreaking um but yeah i've got a lot of shows obviously start work again i'm very much one of those people that tries to see the positive in everything and is one of those people that's like everything happens for a reason and you know I believe everything does happen for a reason and I believe certain people come in and out of your life at certain times for a reason. I'm now going to be doing a highlighter with again the XX Revolution and this is what the highlight looks like. This is beautiful this highlight. It's really nice I love it. Now I'm just going to be curling my eyelashes to obviously put mascara on. <laughs> I genuinely don't mind being in lockdown. I, I think the thing that I miss the most is seeing my friends and going out with my friends because I went out with them like pretty much every night. And I don't mean like out partying out, I mean like we'd go to like bowling and we'd play on the arcades or we'd play pool and snooker and table tennis and things like that like it was little things that we'd do also i'm now just going to do my mascara and i actually do this kind of weirdly i use two different mascaras so i use the bare minerals lash topia which looks just like this i do the first layer with this and then i go in with a second layer with the w7 flirty eyes um I don't know why, it just makes them look nicer, I can't explain it, but it does. Um, so that's how I'll be doing my mascara. I miss working as well actually, I like, I'm very like much, I like working, I, I'm just a working person, I just like to work for some reason. I think that's because I enjoy my job as well, because my job is something that I actually want to do. Um, but yeah, I... There's a lot of things that I miss. I miss seeing my family, obviously. So just like that. And then what I like to do is put eyeliner on my like waterline of my bottom eyelashes. Um, I don't really put it on the top very often. I have the rule of I either put it on the top or the bottom. I don't put it on both because I don't think my eyes suit that. So I'm just going to put it on the bottom and then for a final touch i'm going to be using again the xx revolution and this is a lip gloss in the color sundown looks just like this and yeah just adds a little finishing touch to the makeup look so that's the end look to the makeup and i actually really like it i think it's quite a like natural kind of summery vibe it's a bit sunny today so i thought i might as well go for that <laughs> and yeah this is the end look so that's it for the video i hope you enjoyed the makeup look the little chat that we had and don't forget to smash that thumbs up button subscribe if you haven't already i am trying to reach 150 subscribers which i know i've got quite a way to go but hopefully by the end of april i'll be on 150 which would be very nice leave a comment down below of how your lockdown's been and hopefully i'll see you next week with another video bye